lapel, handheld, or boom. Hi, Taylor here at Financial Potion, where video is your financial potion. And to never miss out on a video, please make sure you subscribe to our channel and then click on that bell so you're notified every Friday at 5 p.m. Arizona time that a new video has been posted. For one-to-one -one training or just to support our content, please click above and connect with us on our Patreon page. When you're choosing to purchase a microphone, it may be very confusing to determine if you should have a lapel, handheld, or boom. First of all, what are they and what are the differences? Number one, a lapel. Honestly, my favorite to use. It's one that's going to be, you know, smaller in size, uh, closer to the person, a nice pack that can just be attached. And then you want to hide that wire and have close to them. The handheld. Now this one's definitely a bit more bulky. It's going to definitely be in the shot, but it could be that look that you are seeking. And then you have your boom. Your boom is going to be either attached to the camera or attached to, you know, some sort of boom holder, boom stick, a C stand. And so that won't be in the shot, but may not be getting as close to the subject as you want. So how do you decide? Like everything with video marketing, you need to think about the end in mind. What do you want your videos to look like? Do you want to make sure that you have a nice spokesperson talking situation with a handheld? Do you want to make sure that you do not see the microphone whatsoever? And that's where you may want to consider a boom. Or are you just wanting to guarantee that you have quality, crisp audio uh, from that particular speaker? That's when you want to consider that lapel microphone. Another thing to consider is how easy do you want to capture people's responses? When you're using a lapel, there's a little bit of a setup time. You need to clip it on them. You need to make sure you weave this wiring underneath their shirt or through a collar so that way it looks nice and clean. It's gonna take a minute or two to mic up each person. And so if you're doing more of a run and gun shoot or if you really just wanna get people's responses very quickly, that's where either the handheld, which will be on camera and shown, or the boom may be a better option. So I hope this video helps you determine whether you should use a lapel, handheld, or boom microphone. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to leave them in the comments below and take a look at our equipment page where we have plenty of recommendations of quality equipment.